Welcome back. Welcome back. Oh, Stupidity. don't don't burn your freaking source magic right out the gate. Good God. I gotta put. I don't know, dude. There's gotta be something better <laughs> to put there. What do you like? Wait, how about this? What's your accidentally <laughs> casting restoration? Like is totally fine. What? So what's your record button? Nine. Nine on the numpad. Well, I just use my record button is uh the the star uh, multiply button on the numpad. Nothing's connected to that. I don't know if that would make it easier for you, but it's right above nine. Well, this guy's full of ideas, isn't he? <laughs> just, just saying. <laughs> uh, also, if you, you might want to come back for a second, because we yeah. uh, remember we we stopped looking over uh across this tower. Yeah, this thing right here. And there's two bodies over there. I think I could teleport. I have the capacity to teleport all of them over to us, or I could teleport Ooh. you into them. No, absolutely not. All right, so I think this is gonna work. I'm gonna do it behind us over here. Maria, that's Maria. You wanna loot her? All right, yeah. Maria had some unidentified gloves. Okay, I can- 330 gold. Nice. Some Farhangite, which I don't know what it is, what and is. Backlash skill book. Backlash? Jump over the enemy, landing behind their back and backstabbing them for 34 to 36 damage. That is a, uh, we did, What's her face has that ability? That's the ability she uses she, to teleport. She has it already. Yeah, she uses one she uses okay. to teleport behind people. So that's something we can sell off. All right, we oh, also I can use it actually. They, I have scoundrel level one. There you go. So. And we can so also I'd send it back to me after. <laughs> Lorenzo, if you want to go loot Lorenzo, and I'll send that back to you. These probably are quest right. people, but uh. Yeah. He's over here. I'll grab him. Wait, 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 wait. Lorenzo. I'm going to send you some stuff you might be able to use as well. I sent you like a belt that I don't know anything about. All right. And, or sorry, no, a belt that I don't. Uh, well, one of these anymore. had uh, one of the armor set that you have. Ooh. There you go. Boots of the okay. Tyrant. I'm also sending you an unidentified pair of gloves. All right, I'll identify them. They are rogue gloves. So they can go to what's her face? Um, crit chance, yeah, initiative, nice. all that good stuff. So we'll get send that over to Sabeel. And I will have her equip them. Yeah, I mean, these, the boots, I'm, I feel like I should put them on just to keep the set bonus possibly going. Oh, we, oh, as soon as I put them on, I'm crippled? Yeah, they're cursed, apparently. Uh, we got hey. an update on the quest. Let's see, artifacts of time. We found some armor called Tracks of the Tyrant, part of a full set, it seems. There's something odd about the armor, it seems, to emit a crippling aura. There's got to be a way we can remove well, that. All right. Well, that's weird. Uh, yeah, I'm going to like, I don't know. Can I, can I bless it or something? I know we tried to do that before. Yeah, I feel like we did try that and it did not work, but you're you feel free. I don't want to use my source point. Yeah, that's also true. Well, there's corpses you could probably drain. No, you don't have purge anymore. Never mind. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Instead, I have enrage and shackles of pain. Well, Who'd you send over this? That was a crate, and it doesn't look, it just smashed. Oh. So that's okay. That. The only thing else over there uh, that I could see is some static cloud arrows. So I'm going to grab those. Two barrels and a knockdown arrow head. Eh, not, not essential. Well, why don't we at least grab the, um, the quiver of static cloud arrows? That way you can have these for, uh, seems sensible. the red prints. There you go. I also, uh, I just sent you half of the gold stack. Oh, nice, nice. I appreciate it. I feel like if we anyone needs gold, we can just share between us, though. So, should be fun. Yeah, but as soon as we go into the shop, I'm just buying whatever. Gotcha. <laughs> All right, well, there you go. Uh, I can't be trusted. Not bad. Not a bad grab. Yeah. Creates a static cloud that sets stun, deals 28 to 29 air damage. Okay. Seems good. Oh, uh, yeah. I definitely yeah. want to buy things this episode as well, for sure. I'm like I'm bereft of gold, but I'll I'll just hang out while you uh while you get that done. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Woo hoo hoo. Hey buddy. Yeah, alright. Um how do we get over here? There's gotta be something we like climbed up. There's no way we teleported. Oh yeah, climbed. We climbed right here. We can't bless the shrieker. Is that I'm gonna try. Right. I don't think it'll work, but no. Get blessed, buddy. <laughs> he's he's blessed. And still real cheap. <laughs> All right, I'm going up here. See you later. Don't okay. get to see you. Still very upset. Yeah, very, very mad. All right. 
there is the little shrine over here where we can uh, transport ourselves where we want to go. Um, mm. Okay, so we've got a bunch of quests still that, that are in our, in our uh, book. I'm just taking a look at them. At Gradion is urging, we are to seek out some soul jars that are hidden in the vault of Brachus Rex. Uh, that's right. Do we, did we ever find the vault of Brachus Rex, though? I don't think I don't that's... There's a few so. quests that lead to the vault, so... We need to find where the vault is. It's kind of like the next major quest. Yeah. Um, and, again, the the maze with all the gargoyles, there's that building uh, with the necromancers yes. that we could talk to and or murder. So I think that's going to be our objective. What would you like to do first? Where is the maze? Well, I think, I think we can also go to this boat now. Yeah, we could just leave the island completely. And okay, so that, but that's like the act exit. Yeah, so, Problem. spoilers, this boat becomes ours. And, we, okay. and this, this we will leave the island and we will never return, basically. Hmm. I'm going to teleport well. to the hideout and buy some things first, I think. Actually, yeah, I think we might have... Maybe we did some quests Maybe that we can get some information for back there. What is it? Where am I going? The abandoned camp? Is that where we're going? No. Amadia Sanctuary. Oh, yep, you are. There it is. Boom. Oh, yeah, I got to get out of this. I immediately you start taking damage thing. because it's healing magic. Thank you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I just start getting destroyed. I forgot about that. You come at last. I'd no doubt you'd find your way to us. Not after we I know you seek answers. I'll tell you what I can. All right. Uh, I don't think I ever went up here either. We just landed on shore. Minutes later, I'll just I'll walk around. If I yeah, find walk, talk. Cool, I'm, I'm talking to Gareth right now, the paladin that we helped. No hope. Most uh. of us were dead in the blink of an eye. She had horrors at her side. Shriekers, they call them. They He's got some sweet heart, shoulders. Firing pure death Dude, in you're telling me. <laughs> I gotta know what plan he's using. <laughs> oh, oh, it's the Void Salamanders. Oh, we gotta fight those too. Yeah, well, I, I found him. Gratian right. told me I went to that armory looking for No rush, no rush. I'll just I'll walk, walk around this area a no bit. Problem. If we do that, the Lady Vengeance is ours. Freedom is ours. I had no doubt. Level up. Ooh. Whoa, what was that for? Uh so I told Gareth we cleared the way of the shriekers and they can go. Ah. Gareth's voice nicely done. Well. Oh, I think everybody who sells things is leaving now though. Oh no. Yeah, that's a problem. <laughs> Everybody's leaving. Why would you... Are you leveling uh, wits, by the way? Uh, not really. Are I put you a... the wits boy? I, I don't put too much in wits. I have, I usually usually do um, intelligence and memory. Memory so I have more spells to play with. Okay, so I should have somebody of me or the Red Prince develop wits. Perhaps. Yeah, or Sabeel, which I don't really... I don't think I put anything in that, but I'll double check. Uh... I want to level up necromancy as well as summoning. So, summoning two. Yeah, let's go with summoning here. So I can learn this. So, infusion. Yeah, Unlock whirlwind and rush for your incarnate. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, everybody bounced. Well, I didn't expect that to happen, but I guess it makes sense. I'm like the most boring, the most boring <laughs> level up person on planet. <laughs> Every level, I'm actually like, uh, plus five percent passive damage bonus, please. You know, people are saying that it might not be a <clears throat> bad idea for you to put points into um, Hydro Fist and get yourself like some healing spells. I mean, you could do that, I no problem. It doesn't cost you mana or anything. So, well, I have a restoration already. True. Uh, what do I want to give her? Do we but I need? might not have as of the time that this video goes up, to be fair. Mm. Uh, can I get a quick save? Yep. Just, just popping some points just scared in. Because there's the... Uh, yeah, thank you. The uh, angry things are around me. Yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm on my way over to you right now so we can hopefully fight them. Yeah, I'll let you talk to them because you got the pet pal perk. Oh, <clears throat> I tried to talk to them last time and they were just yelled at me and like, be gone! And then they started fighting. All right, I'll just walk up then. Yeah, go for it. I am your death. 
I shall take your soul. All right, we're all in. Sweet. All right, Mr. Man. Big spooky void salamander. <laughs> uh, all right. Ooh, can I? Ooh, but what if I? Ooh, okay, okay, okay. hear me, hear me. Out. So the red ones have high physical armor. The green ones have low physical armor. Red ones have high physical. So yeah, yeah, they're, they're the ones. Uh, the red ones are magic yep. focused, I guess. Yep, yep. But I still think. Well, well, I doubt they can teleport. Taz Dingo. So, Taz Dingo. <laughs> Sorry, I just got to get it out of me. Dude, I've been playing uh, Anna in Heroes of the Storm. How is she? I think she's really fun. I see. Sinvicta hates yes, her. I see Sinvicta bitch about her a lot, but he bitches about every new hero. Oh, ooh, he, I nice. remember him liking Zukov. You see my game plan here? Yeah, yeah. I don't know if this is going to work, but we'll try. Stance, all right. Uh, is he doing anything? Hello? Hello? <laughs> Noxious Void Salamander. Oh, hello. there he goes. He's, oh, okay. He's, yeah. he's pulling an XCOM and he's just thinking for a minute. <laughs> not uh, great, but not okay, Sabeel. They have low magic armor, so I'm thinking maybe just whittle his magic armor down. He's so far away, I can't get to him in one turn, so. Yeah. Why don't we go here? Try and get rid of some of that magic armor. And then I'll move up a little bit, and that'll be that. Oh, well, that's fine. Yeah, that's not that bad. Yeah. All right. I don't have magical attacks, unfortunately. Sets in rage for one turn. It's muted. Clears taunted, terrified, charmed, mad, clear minded. Oh, it clears clear minded. That stinks. That is not good. Is all right, so I'm gonna move up to, to tank a little bit, I think. And I, I really, be on the lookout for like a taunt skill book. Yeah. Cause I would mm -hmm. love to, I would love to taunt. That would be good. So I'll get an attack of opportunity there and I'm going to, I think Sabeel's gonna be fine until her next turn probably. Yeah, she's so gonna be fine. I am going to use unability. <laughs> that is I'm gonna nuke this guy's physical armor. Alright. Because we're gonna we're gonna go on him afterwards. Probably. Makes sense. Oh, there's four salamanders actually. I thought there was only three. There's one way at the back. There is? I don't think he's in the fight yet. Oh no, he's, he's dead. I think it's the dead yeah, I think you're looking at the dead one. Alright. Yeah. Uh alright, so I'm going to summon. And then I'm going to use my new ability. Dude, this freaking soul tyrant. He goes last and first. <laughs> I get That's to infuse amazing. him with some new abilities. What does that do? Uh, so it gives him extra armor. Uh, let's see. Unlocks Whirlwind and Rush for your incarnate and provides Ooh. 65 physical armor as well. That's pretty great, actually. Yeah, that's pretty good. And then outside of that, and I'm actually just going to end my turn and then he goes so let's see whirlwind is the thing that you do yes and then it doesn't hit allied characters battery you don't know how many tweets i got recently about knockdown not hitting allied characters <laughs> by the way <laughs> they were so far ahead you know what i mean like it doesn't yeah no i mean i only recently figured it out like two episodes ago and i'm a little embarrassed but still. <laughs> taunt blocked by physical armor apparently mm. Well, I get to go again, so we whirlwind. It's pretty good. And that's, there you go. He's slightly better now. All right. Okay. Dude, I absolutely should have saved all of my ricochet abilities until just now, <laughs> but so be it. Um, poison explodes, so. Poison does blow up. Mm -hmm. I'm going to abstain from that for the time being and instead smack this dude. I think this fight is in the bag already. Yeah, it's not looking bad, huh? Um, I don't need first aid. Who's low on physical? Sabeel could use some, I suppose, if nothing else. There we go. Out I of gave her clear minded. <laughs> oh. All right. 
That seems fine. Out of curiosity, uh, on the initiative bar, what's that mysterious figure? Do we know? Do you see that? Where? At the on the initiative bar at the top, right after yeah. me, like that. Oh, yeah. that's maybe that's the mysterious voices. Oh me. Oh, you might be right. You might be right. Okay. Well, I gotta put myself in fire if I'm gonna do anything good. So let's just do it. Nice. Yeah. Whoa. All right. It also like set off Necrofire or something. Yeah, there's some curse happening somewhere that's making Necrofire happen. Uh, I have no magic armor, so I'm gonna move even though there's an attack of opportunity. Okay. Though, how much does that cost? One. I'm gonna try something. So I'm shackling this guy. Okay. So every time I get hit, he will also get hit. Okay. Oh, he's, he gets blocked by physical arm. Fair enough. And I didn't get an attack of opportunity. I don't think you Better. left his melee range. I think you're still in it. Mm, That's oh, why. you have to leave it. Okay, yeah. I see. Um, I'm going to knock down the one at the back. Works for me. Um, all right. I am going to see if this does what I hope it does. And we're just going to cause it to rain blood. Nice. And it would have put out the fire, I think, if it wasn't cursed, actually. That's fine. Yeah, it cannot be extinguished, it says. Mathis. You didn't get hit, did you? I did indeed get hit. Oh. Well, here, take... As rep as recompense, <laughs> take that in return. What is happening? Woo. Ah, it's Sabeel's dad or possibly her god woken. Her, That's her cho neat. chosen deity. All right, cool. Well, he's right here, so let's Thank God I moved very slightly out of the way of that. <laughs> Sick. Uh, this guy's got to go. Oh, yeah, it's Blessed Water now where that is. Interesting. Oh, dude, I'd lost memory and as a result I can't use elemental arrowheads anymore. How did you lose memory? Good. Gear swap or? Yeah, gear swap. Oh. That's correct. Hmm. That just means you got to replace one of the spells that you have. Yeah. There's, there's some that I like almost never used. Good miss. Good miss. Is that a threat? Okay. Is that a threat? What do you mean? Yeah. What do you mean by that? <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm very curious as to what you mean by that. Nice. Easy. Yeah, that All was right. easy money. Dark Pearl. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did you hear that? <laughs> yeah, well, I, I think I accidentally had Sabeel uh, attack me. Oh, how the mighty have <laughs> fallen. Uh, Earth right. Essence and that one. So let's see what they were protecting. Water Barrel, which I did not mean to pick up. I found something. <laughs> oh, somebody got something oh. from a uh, perception check. Where is it? It's oh, a mound it of sand. Dig away, royalty. Uh, mask mask of strength. strength. Ooh, nice. You want to take the other two? Oh, is there other things there? Oh, yeah, I'll grab. Yeah. I'll, see I'll, I'll, I'll pick up the one and we can sort it. Because I got three things. I got the ring of intelligence that was there. See, that seems like it's perfect for you. Yeah. Uh, so, I received Mask of Strength, plus one strength, plus 10% poison resist, three magic armor, 16 physical. It's not quite as good as my helm, so if you would like it, you can, uh... Nah, no, the strength it. is useless to me, really. I'm gonna hold it then, because I don't know what's happening with these tyrant things. I've spotted a trap. Oh, you spotted a trap. Yeah, there's a couple then, of traps over here, but... I got Amulet of the Wind, which I'm actually gonna give to, uh my dude so i actually have a hand me down 11 magic armor plus one wit plus 10 percent poison resist amulet can you use that what was it poison resist plus one wit plus 10 and plus one wit and 11 magic armor sure send it my way if you have nothing better for it i think i can do yeah, something with go. it okay well i got and that's it all right that wasn't bad sweet uh all right we want to whoop wasn't there, uh, wait, there's like a cave entrance or something down here? 
Oh, this is the gargoyle area right here. This is the gargoyle maze. No. <laughs> Wait. Oh no, no, dude! I found a, I found an ice cave. Oh sweet! Let's go. Yeah, dark. Cave. Ooh, the vault of Brackus Rex. Oh, let's. Wait, go. where did you go? Oh, Little there it is. Yep. Flag. All right, there yeah. we go. Oh hell yeah! Okay, let's save it. This is we what we're looking for. Explore it carefully. Is that what the quest said? It is indeed. Sweet. So remember, we have those armor pieces, but we might be missing, like, I think we're missing the chest plate. And legs and gloves. I mean, and gloves mm. and whatever else is possible. Oh. Hey. hey, you. Let me see what you've got under there. Tromp doy. Go on. Go on. Show me your... Oh, way to let him finish. Pekka. <laughs> Oh, he just want—he straight up just wants to see my dick. Uh, okay. Uh, let's see. Tell him he has more chance to change his tone, or he's gonna regret it. Yeah, hard enough. He's a dead man. Uh, ignore his childish comments and ask him where exactly you are. Why are you still speaking? If there was a cave to explore, do you think I'd tell you? How awkward. See. Wow. He's rude, right? Just stop. Trump doy. No one cares. <laughs> Trump doy. Tell him he has one more chance to change his tone, or he's gonna regret Still it. Still opening that mouth of yours, are you? Careful with that. I quite like the. I mean, dude, I'm a skeleton, boy. right? Come on. <laughs> See, the thing is, just stop. I'm gonna leave Until the fool be. No. Because you see, quest update. You he never know. Your honor. Well, I don't have any honor. Let's be honest. Strange man named Trompto within the cavity mocks and threatens us. Yeah, I have a feeling he'll be useful later. Oh, it's an illusionary crate. Oh, these crates are all fake. They're all illusions. Cool. Well. All right, Tromp Door, we'll see you around, buddy. Good luck. Does this one, this mean right here, reinforced? Nope, that one's not an illusion. I've been uh, taken to picking up, like, mushrooms and stuff. Because I've yeah, been trying to uh, crafting and, and whatnot when I can. So can we not go through there? Okay, we can't go through there. It appears that is correct. Well, maybe Are we going to like the moon pool or something? We cannot. But well, we got to do something with Tromp Doy. There's a. It looks like let me, let me talk to him because I got the, I got the hat. Sure. Maybe he's like, hey, you're Brachus Rex. Uh, oh, hey, look, found it. Oh. Hmm. He called us clever. Wow. Until next time. He he said he wanted to see my breasts. <laughs> that's odd. That's, Terribly sexist, but hilarious at the same time. Trump toy. <laughs> I really, he was like, hey, <laughs> what do you got there? And I was like, nice. <laughs> it's the hat. Oh, that's awesome. It was not the hat. It wasn't. All right. Let's see. Wow, like stained a... pants. Hell yeah, what stained pants. I wonder, maybe I should They're probably Trump Doy stained pants, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but perhaps, yeah. <laughs> perhaps. Whoop, he's back, he's over here. Fake Trump Doy. Oh, game. Hello? You can't teach uh, did you anything. did it crash? I'm i I'm still going here, but like I'm walking around. You are in a fight with Trump Doy. Yeah, he yelled at us for staying sticking around. There's two maybe. Trump Doys. One's a melee and one's toys. not a melee. All right, well. Oh yeah, there's one right up here. Who Let's... stands actually no chance of surviving. Yeah. I'm just gonna go ham on him with uh, the Sabeel here. He's an illusion. Yeah. This one's not real. You... You're still slicing him though. Well, yeah, it's too late now. All right, well. You think, you think that's fake Tromptoy? Or do you think they're both illusions? They might actually both be illusions. We'll find out. But. He didn't do anything. Yeah, and he just didn't do jack. I don't know. Tromptoy, what's going on? What He's an illusion, situation. too. I don't know. Oh. There's, there's that Tromptoy. Well, maybe we have to fight them regardless. Well, I will. I will destroy this one. I gotta move in there anyway. Rude. Eh. That's pretty bad. Well, luckily I don't need to move anywhere. 
Um. Yeah. Then I will buff him. There we go. Um, and then I will melt the frozen stuff underneath me and the red prince, as well as try to do some damage. Now that was a good move. Battering, okay, the battering ram. Let's go up here. He is also, huh, interesting. Hmm. Well, we gotta get rid of him one way or another. What in the world are you doing, buddy? <laughs> He's leaving icy uh, ground for me to potentially slip on, it looks like. Rude. Though also relatively impressive. Smart. Clever. Yeah, well, yeah. there we go. There she goes. <laughs> I really, I'm actually really impressed with how the AI works. They, yeah. they seem, they, they kind of handled the situation intelligently most of the time. So wait, why did he make it rain? Oh... Okay. Electrified puddle. Got it. Yeah, not fantastic. Um, well, if Sabeel's out, I kind of want to tackle this dude then. Oh, there he goes. Wow, that was a lot of experience. For, level, five, for level fives. Yeah. Think. Smack him. And then... Yak him. Give him the old smack and yak. Down he goes. Yeah. I will... I don't want to go down there. Okay. He's burning, right? It worked. Yeah. Okay. I mean, it did hit me, but I'll, right. I'll accept it. You know, oh, collateral damage. Yeah, that's. I figured it was going to be minimal damage if it did hit you. Nice. And he Good. died. Sweet. Hey, it's a chest. Ooh, nice. Ornate Excuse chest. Me. Big, big tromp toy? First of all, tromp toy. Pathetic boy. Tromp toy, what the? <laughs> In what world? He's subverting our expectations. <laughs> Damn it, Trump Doy. That was even easier. All right, Trump Doy. I look forward to your next test. Yeah, there's nothing we can do. I'm not even convinced that that one's real, and if we did murder him, anything would happen. All right, we've got two options here. We've got like this. Oh, yeah, the, the ornate showroom. Yeah, we got a showroom over here, and then to our left, we got a gigantic icicle, like, in a puddle over here. See uh, it? You gotta look at the showroom, dude. All right, I'm in. Let's do it. Mysterious room. You come to find, you come to search, but you won't find the way. Pity. I cannot help you. I cannot help you. I only give the questions. I am listening in. Don't worry. Rackus has willed it. Trump Doy must you abide. Have the unfortunate guardian of this vault. Yes, we have. <laughs> you are kinder to him than fate has been. Do you wish to move forward? Listen closely. Okay, Make okay, okay. Rackus is a bloody, rotten, thieving, very, very awful fellow. Some even call him a cur. A cur is. Bloody, rotten, thieving, very, very awful fellow. A cur is. Uh. <laughs> hang on. Rotten, a very. Bloody, awful. I'm trying to figure it out. You know nothing. Yes, listen closely. Brackers I'm thinking. Bloody, rotten, thief, go backwards. Very, very awful fellow. Some even call him awful, Kerr. rotten. Kerr is either you're very good at guessing or the slightest. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> listen closely. Nice. And make source is a scourge, a devil, a misery, a blight, a hex, a curse. And yet, the cure is. The cure is... I'm not understanding this, are you? Because <laughs> I'm... Not yet. Oh, no, no, no. I think I got it, dude. Okay. Enlighten so he's me. Giving us, he's giving us six adjectives. Yeah. One for each letter in the word that he starts the sentence with. So for source, he's, he's got scourge, devil, misery, blight, hex, curse. The cure oh. is C, which is the fifth word. It's a hex, a misery, a blight, and a curse. Oh, I Perhaps see. You're not totally incapable after all. 
Or maybe it doesn't matter in any case. The path is the open. Path Go is freely. Open. Get dusted, son. What was the path? Oh, this door over here. <laughs> Get absolutely crap. That was good stuff. Who's a mirror? The By mirror. superior intellect. <laughs> All right, before we go through the door and push forward, let's go see what this icicle's about in case it gets locked. Yeah, away. yeah. Also, maybe save it. Quick save. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Good call. Oh yeah, don't open these doors. That's the whole reason we avoided the. Yeah, no, no. But I want to see what this little icicle is down here. Dude, you got a pill for the silverware, dude. <laughs> Sell it off. Here. Crafting Bible Part 11. Gotta peep that, even though I never craft. It's a well-worn chest. Five new recipes learned. I'm learning those for you. What were they? I have no idea. Can I melt? No. God, I hate it. I always go up to a globe, and I expect it to... Uh, open up and have like a decanter of whiskey inside <laughs> they always go and i thought rivalon was flat all right there was really there's only a scroll of uh of haste down here okay nothing really thrilling all right all right Let's down to going down to this weird place mysterious room there and, must be like ice bridges here all right part of me for my own curiosity yeah, yeah. We're going doing? into this little side room. Oh, yeah, okay. Ooh. Uh, a dagger. We'll take a look at that. And, uh, and a trap. Okay, well. Can't win them all. Still. A dagger and some gold. I'll take it. Yeah. Sweet. All right. Whoop, whoop. Let me guess. <laughs> you could probably Trump. guess correctly. Trump doy. It's all it's Trump doy. All right, Trump doy. So I'm imagining you could probably put your incarnate on one of the bridges to take care of the... Uh... Yeah, I'll probably be able to get him on one side. And then, like, melee dude has low magic armor. Yeah, but I'm going to go after him anyway. That's fine. Try and do some damage. Yeah, some good. I can also teleport if you want to go on one of the sides. Yeah. Do you remember? I don't think we need to. Uh, maybe, maybe not. First off, this dude. What do you? I don't really love you standing here, but that's fine. Since you've started on this guy, I will continue. Might as well. I think I love his name oh. though. Didn't even see that guy. All right. All right. Now your physical armor is done. Not yours. But you know what I mean. Yeah, yeah. Um, but I, I don't know if it's worth a knockdown. I mean, what's, eh, the, what's the cooldown on your knockdown? It's like four turns. Gotcha. Four turns. I keep looking for like the the more clever move, but I don't <laughs> think it exists. <laughs> Not yet. When we get higher levels and stuff. I'm going to try... Oh, but it's blocked by physical armor. That's right. Yeah, okay. I think I am going to just smack this dude. Oof, nice. You've hit hard now. Yeah, that oh, new hey. sword is not... Oh! <laughs> Here we are like, all right, we got to be careful. <laughs> that new sword that uh, we found last episode is really good. The two ep Last episode. I'm curious. Yeah, I see him. <laughs> I think I will use Whirlwind. Mm. I was trying to see if I could teleport him off the side. I can. Sure. Shoot. Oh, I gotta pick somebody. Never mind. Um, here. You. And where can I put you? Can I dump you off the side? No, I can't. All right, screw it. That would be sick, though. Yeah, if there was, like, water or lava, I know you can. Like, just dump them in the lava. But there, if, if it's just an endless pit, not so much. Nice. And I'll infuse him with some power. I can see why people say summons are great. Yeah. And then I'll just do this. And have him 
start beating him down. Where did he go? He's up near your, uh... Oh, confusion. okay. All right. I don't well. think my character actually gets wet. <laughs> like, she's wet. I, I'm not necessarily comfortable to say, but <laughs> she's afflicted by the wet status effect right now. <laughs> However, um, I think on her turn, she gets warm because of the helmet. All right, so be careful, though, because that shit's ice now, so. Yeah. What am I going to do with you? I guess try and get behind him. Oh, we can, I can examine him for stats. That's cool. Let's see if I can get behind him and just... That's about it. Excuse me, where's my attack of opportunity? <laughs> <laughs> alrighty, alrighty. Wish I could shoot farther. I mean, I... They're not really healing, so... Yeah. Kind of just like content to keep whittle, whittling them down. Yeah, it'll, it'll get the job done eventually. <laughs> like that, <laughs> that was a big mistake really on his end. Yeah, that's really good for me. Um, I don't have to move to smack him, I think. So, oh, I had to move just a little bit. And he's done then. Yep. Goodbye. Okay, executed. With impunity. This guy's done too. Get dusted, son. Nice. You only use that once per, only get executed once per turn, I guess. But that's acceptable. Um, I'm gonna go over here. Let's move nice. him. I think that's very good. And then just to be safe, so you don't freaking trip and fall. Nice. And then get down here. Uh, there's a dude up there, actually. I should go after him. Oh, knock him down. Sweet. He's really good. All right. Uh, I mean, it burns up some action on his end, at least. Yeah, yeah, of course. I mean, we're, we should win pretty easily, I think. Yeah, I think we're, we're pretty much guaranteed at this point. He's still got a not too much physical. Nice. Okay. Good stuff. I have to move. Let's go. Ah, you know what? No, 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 wrong move, wrong move, wrong move. <laughs> That's the wrong Oh, move. you're just gonna move to him. Yeah, but like maybe try something like this. And, no, don't shoot him, shoot him. Shoot him, shoot him. 116, this guy's got like pretty low HP. Who goes next? Bergdorna goes next. So I mean, we had, which, it's which like- Which one is? The, that guy. All right. No, I, but still, like, it's good practice, you know. Never mind. This guy's too far anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Disregard. Uh, get clear minds on myself. And then get smoked. Also, okay, before you go, somebody said that there was a button we could press near our health bar that if we don't want to go yet, you can actually click it and it'll put you at the oh. end of initiative. The shield, yeah. The layers. Oh, there. really? Oh, sweet. So if you don't want to move, you want me to teleport you or something? I can't. I can't do. By the way, I'm just saying as theory crafting. That's cool. Yeah, that makes sense. We can, we can I, move. I had not uh, considered that. At first, I was like, "That, why would I ever want to do that?" But it's all set up, there, man. Tactics. There is a that is actually smart. You should consider sometimes delaying Sabil's turn. Yeah, my that, should. On my turn, I can give her Enrage, which gives her... Her first turn is all crits. Yeah, that's that's useful. But she kind of crits anyway, I suppose. She also does do that. I don't think that'll hit. This might get the knockdown. We might as well try. Sweet. Yeah. And I don't know. Everyone else is doing fine. So enjoy, Mathis. Thanks, thanks. All right. Well, I don't think I can reach freaking anyone. No, I gotta move closer. Nice. All right. 
Not getting two kills this time, but like one. That's acceptable. Run. We're getting a lot of experience. Yeah, this is in this cave. For how for how low level they are, like level five compared to us. Are we six or seven actually? Do we just turn seven? I feel yeah. I feel like we just turned seven this episode, right? Yeah. So the, I mean, these guys are pretty easy, but seventy nine. Is there a way? <laughs> The actual way is probably just wait for him to move and you get an attack of opportunity, but eh, nothing else. You know what? I want to try this. I want to shackle him. Click on him. Nah, click on him. Drop, the, <laughs> drop There we go. <laughs> so now, whenever I take damage, he will take damage. He's immune to bleeding. All right. Well, lesson learned. Shackling. Alright. Now you see it. Now you don't. What? Alright, free experience. Oh. Or he's um. dead. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> well, quest update. We have killed Trompdoy, is just what it that's the last thing it said. Really? Yep. We have killed you are correct. That is awesome. <laughs> <laughs> we have killed Trompdoy. Well, he kinda had it coming. Dude, y'all 100% had it coming. What a jerk. There is a, a treasure chest over here. Can't reach it. No invisible pathway, but luckily. Yeah. We can teleport things. Uh, Teleportation skill book. Oh, hell yes. I'm taking That's that. That's huge. And then there's just a necklace of frost. Or necklace of the forest, rather. It gives 10 magic armor, and that's it. Do you want that? I'll think about it, Mathis. Right. We got a we got a quick save here. The Eternal Worshipper. Oh, I found that's the Soul Jars. I'm on my way. Um, what's the Eternal Worshipper? We found the Soul Jar of Gratiana. Gratiana. You must be very careful on what to do with it. Okay, well, what does she want us to do? What's oh, the there's a purging one too. That's really useful. Look at the pile of gold. Like you can actually just click on the pile of gold. <laughs> I think she wanted us to bring it back. Okay, I'm saving it again just to be safe. Supernova skill book. I have the spell, so. Get sold, son. Uh, Granny is urging we are to seek out some soul, some soldiers that are hidden in the vault of Brachus Rex. We have found the soldier, Granny. We must be very careful to do Matt, it. Mathis, it's what, El Dorado. I do, it, it just it feels too good to be true. Here, I'm sending you an unidentified helmet. Okay. Sending you an unidentified staff. Sending you a telekinesis potion. Yo, you're gonna want this helmet. Oh. Sending it to Berg Thora. Enjoy. The treasure. Small masterwork rune. I'm gonna touch the pile of gold. Yeah, 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 yeah. There's nothing in it. That doesn't make like actually. Oh, it's because I I stole from it earlier. Oh, okay. Uh, I was yeah, like... yeah, yeah. I just I picked up like <laughs> like infinity gold. Here, I'm gonna give you uh, probably half of what I got is probably like 190, so send it over. Keep it as equitable as possible. The Iron Dog, that's the one you sent over? Dude, that's extremely good. But I'm not sure. It might be, uh, might be better for the Red Prince. He doesn't have the strength necessary to use it. Hmm. The door opens, and a tall, beautiful woman stalks this. into the room. Oh, She's I also got a sick bow. Let me take a look at that. All right, yeah, you take a look at it. Oh, dude, yeah, it's way better. See the fear in the dwarf. I've been using that Magister's crossbow for like twenty years. <laughs> you got magical <laughs> elven crossbow. The dwarf tries to set atrophy for one turn, twenty percent chance to succeed. Let's go. As she's dragged away to a tower, you hear her cursing. All right. Um. So. We have several soul jars. Might I uh, <laughs> acquiesce something first? Oh, I'm, are you talking to one? I'm of in now? the middle. Of, I've been in the. You're sorting through loot, and I'm like laying my hands on the jars. Oh lord. <laughs> oh, you can talk to somebody. Um, you pull your hand away from the jar. Your head is swimming. You can feel the dwarf's cold terror still throbbing in your bones. Ooh, that's sad. Absorb the soul inside. Yo, that's like that alone. Gotta try, I right? gotta like. Something inside you strains. You are replete, 
You cannot oh, it's it's source. That's all it is. Okay, hang on. There's there's talking to happen. The vision fades. What vision was that? I can do little but to condemn that necromancer. I, any sins can be forgiven under the right circumstances. Oh, this from the vision I just had, I guess. Okay, yeah. gotcha. Uh, uh, let's see. I've rarely seen such cowardice on display. Honestly, making the dead do menial work sounds kinder than having the living do it. Can't say I agree. <laughs> well, actually, I'm gonna click on this again and just take the jar. I'm gonna listen in on this one. Luckily, it is a lizard one. Maybe That's we'll get true. some unique dialogue. As you roam, the human apes turn away from you, all but one. He promises power for a price. You try to fight, try to reclaim what's yours, but a woman takes you by the hand and leads you to a tower. He promised he'd take me home, you cry. You are home. She's my Whoa, creepy. <laughs> um, skin, so it only gonna... gives you, like, uh, yeah, slip it into your backpack, I think would be my suggestion. No, I'm going to smash it to pieces. Okay, you're going to free him? Free the tortured soul from the <laughs> inside of this jar. All right, go for it. see a shape emerge from the ruins of the broken jar. A lizard in the... Rest well, lizard prince. Well. Oh. Lizard's visions fade. He committed his crimes out of pain, not malice. He ought to be forgiven. Eh. Uh, can't help but sympathize with them. He just wanted to go home. I can't help but have a bit of sympathy. Why? I'm picking yeah. the dialogue. I, and it's making the Red Prince say it. That makes me so mad. Yo, it's Trompdoy's soul jar. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Oh, yes. It is at once a brightly colored motley and also a deep gray. He's, he's begging for me to destroy the jar. Yeah. What are you gonna do, Mavis? Uh, I'm gonna listen in on what 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 happened first. So from what I could tell, Brachus Rex has like this necromancer lady, and she's going around capturing people and ripping their souls out. Yeah. With a jerk, your mind is being a real jerk about it. It's filled with cheers, but you can feel the fear dripping from the walls. You see a jester prance in the court. He casts illusion. That's got to be Trump, Doy. Master's cruelty by picking on the weakest in the room. What an asshole! He lives for the mm -hmm. laughter and applause. The scene spins. A new face. A new fool to make his master laugh. Don't worry, he's told. You'll always have your place. The door closes, and you see the illusionist in the dark of this dungeon. He's alone, surrounded by gold and deathly silence. Your hand falls from the jar. Your All right. Trickling and cold after the vision, to die that Come with me. You're putting him in the backpack? Yep. <laughs> the visions fade to black, but the memories. Whatever he did in the past, he suffered for it. The <laughs> sin should be forgiven. I have to. I have to role play. I <laughs> know. No, that's that. And I'm doing the same by taking his soul in my bag. Uh, associating with tyrants validates their actions. He might not have killed anyone, but he enabled their murder. Let him suffer on. He might have he normalized had reasons it. to associate. <laughs> We don't know his life. He should be given peace. I agree. <laughs> he should be left to suffer. Leave him in the dark to mull over his own belly button. <laughs> Yo, well, you don't get to touch this one. You're I, know, I know, I know, I <laughs> know. The soul jar rocks slightly. Light, as soon as you touch the jar's cracked surface, you, the vision shifts. You uh. see burning villages. What's the, what are we looking to do with this one? I don't know. I thought I would just take it back to her. To oh, okay. Is it belong to somebody? I can't remember. One of the people in the village, like the the camp that we uh, discovered, the hideout, I should say. Okay. She was she was like, "Hey, get this thing," and I was like, "Yeah," <laughs> but I don't remember what she wants me to do with it. So I yeah, just grab it. Did you just get a new quest update there? Is it regret? No. Did you? It looks like Sabeel and the Red Prince do, or maybe they, they have something to say. Yeah, now, they have I something suppose. to say. Yeah. Welcome to the backpack. The terrible vision fades. No one is beyond forgiveness. Whatever her sins, she can always redeem herself. While she lived a selfish she lie, okay, well. Children. She cannot be forgiven. However her life began, it ended well. Wow, Sabeel is like the exact today. opposite. Yeah, she's like, she's me. All right, wait, 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 wait. Oh, I wonder if we can open this, this lever now. Oh, yeah. Nice little exit way. Also, then... good 
time for us to stop the, the episode. But Except before we do, what did they want this was meant to be with this somehow, soul jar? Ah, we've encountered a mysterious masked princess known as Gradiana who worships the goddess Amadia. When did we find her? What, what is the quest the called? Jar. The Eternal Worshipper. Uh, we have encountered a mysterious masked priestess known as Gradiana who worships the goddess Adamad Amadia. Maybe she's back at Fort Joy? It's possible. No, 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 no. she's in the hideout. But... Okay, well, if she's in the hideout, then she's gonna be by the beach now. They're all gonna be waiting for us by the beach, mm. so. But all I'm right. also like, does she want, Does is the quest wrong? Is it, We it shouldn't say we encountered a mysterious masked priestess known as Amadia who worships the goddess Gradiana? No, because we just we just picked up Gradiana's soul, didn't we not? Yeah, yeah, exactly. So why would Gradiana be the god if she's trapped? Amadia is the god. Gradiana well, we is the girl. Gradiana's soul jar. Yeah. I see. You see, I'm losing my mind here. Anyway, <laughs> thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. We'll solve this conundrum on the next episode. If you enjoyed it, click the like button. Helps out a great deal. Of course, subscribe if you want to see more in the future. For now, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Goodbye.